Glock Precision here, and uh, it's an exciting day. I happen to get my core um, everyday carry belt in the mail today, and I am super excited to get this thing open and uh, set it up. So we're gonna do that. Let's uh, get that open. Oh, any more tape anywhere? No. Ooh, baby. See, I like how they uh, welcome you. <laughs> Core Essentials. Um, I actually heard about this belt from Tier 1 Concealed, which I'm going to throw a shout out to them. Best holsters ever. My favorite holsters. Uh, this is my new Axis Elite in the um, plaid, the red plaid, and it's a badass. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, buckle. Um... Wrench, set screws, and um, the keeper, I guess, for that's what they call it. So let's see here. Let's, uh, let's pull everything out. Papers, what's in here? I'm assuming this is my invoice or something. That would be correct, invoice. So uh, after all said and done on this bad boy, the belt was um, 60 bucks. Um, I got the, uh, what is this, like the X6, I think, buckle. I'd have to actually look. I don't remember which one it was. Let's find out. It is the uh, X6. Yeah. So it's the X6. Um, I like the uh, honeycomb kind of print in there. I'll show that up close. Check that out. That's pretty badass, right? All right. So let's just get everything unwrapped. Get this thing out of the uh, plastic. Let the cat play with that. All right, so um, sizing, pretty darn simple. Um, you basically just take your pant size and add six inches and cut there and should be good to go. I don't have scissors on me right now. Just a second. Here, I'll sit there. You can look at my gun for a couple seconds. Back with the scissors. Making videos is stupid. So let's, uh, obviously you don't want to cut on the track because that's stupid. Use your brain here, people. If you uh, have this belt and you bought it, then you probably carry a gun. And if you carry a gun, hopefully you're not stupid. So that's what I'm saying. So pant size here, 34. Add six would be 40. So... I will cut right on the 40 line, nice and straight, hopefully. Oh my god, these scissors aren't the best. My scissors suck a little. Woo -hoo -hoo. Extra, bam! Okay. Uh, do I have a lighter on me to burn these frayed edges? Uh, yeah. Imagine that. There's a lighter right there. There we go. Bam. Look at that. All right. Buckle. Should be uh, pretty self-explanatory. Um, should be anyway. So, belt buckle goes in like so. Um, oh, set screws. Yeah, I want to loosen those or take them out or whatever. Okay, I see they give you extra ones here. They got three extras in the bag. In my head, I was thinking that I had to put them in myself. So let's uh, pull these bad boys out. Let's pretend like we've used Allen wrenches before. Yeah. It's not our first rodeo. I'm like, I'm a framer. I don't, I don't deal with little stuff like this. Uh, classic framer thing to say. All right, here we go. Let's uh, just slide it in. And so, I mean, let's get where you can see what's going on here. So, I took the set screws out right here. Um, now, the buckle just slides into this opening right here, and it's gonna hit flat like that. But of course, I wanna do this the right way. So, put it this way, slide till it goes in. And then this little lever right here 
this little loop. Just push it down and bam! Clamp that sucker shut. That's, uh, yeah, that's nice and tight. That ain't going nowhere. And then let's throw these uh, screws back in here. Whoop, don't drop them. Let's pretend like we know what we're doing, right? All right, here we go. Oh, there it is. I like to get them just started a little. Bam. Now, stick that sucker in there. And now they say don't tighten them down too hardcore. I'm just getting them in there until they're flush, basically, is where you want them with the uh, back of the belt buckle. Okay, I'm gonna turn this over. And yeah, right there. Okay. I'm excited about this belt. Before this, I had a uh, blue Alpha Gear everyday carry belt. And I like it. It's a great belt, honestly. Uh, blue Alpha has got good stuff. But the buckle, um, that Cobra buckle, is just, uh, you know, kind of doesn't look like it should be there. So I think that's it. Look at that. So here this goes in. <laughs> I love that sound. It's like a zip tie know it's working okay now there's this little lever on the bottom here I don't know if you can see if see if I get out of the light there so you can see this little lever it's uh, right here okay I think you just uh, push that in or push it up or push it out oh yeah you just push it out and so if you were wearing the belt you would hold it like that and pull it out so push it in and then just that to take it out it's actually super easy and kind of badass now Let's try it on. Crotch shot. I'm like, oh yeah, shout out to the uh, Tier 1 Concealed. They got some dope hoodies and shirts at Tier 1. Seriously. Uh, there's like a dozen that I need to order. They're really cool. Um, this is the 15 plus 1. If you know, you know. Take it off. Put it on. So this little dingus thing here just goes over like so it's kind of a it's got a weird little if you look at this uh a thing like that so obviously the uh this end would go to the inside of the belt obviously i mean maybe it's not obvious i don't know that's why i said it because maybe it's not so obvious all right back on let's do this and honestly i ordered this belt from core directly and it got here in um like, as soon as it said it shipped, it was here like two days later. It, it came really fast, which is exciting. Okay, I might have made this a little long. I might have to redo it and recut it, but for now, we're not going to worry about that. We're just going to put it on there. Go under. I got to leave it a little bit loose, obviously, for, the, uh, for my gun. So, gun... Make sure my pants are up in the upright and locked position. Because <laughs> I think once I put this on there, I can tighten the belt down. See, so the belt I was using before is just embarrassing. Because my uh, Alpha, Blue Alpha gear belt, I actually loaned to a buddy. You know, because I'm such a nice guy. And, uh, well, you know what happens when you loan stuff out. You don't see it again. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's nice. I miss a good gun belt like I used to have. And this one is kick-ass for the adjustments. I'm going to be honest. Here, let me just try and get my crotch right up in the camera for you. My bad. Well, I think it looks great. Buckle off to the side just a little. This is kind of badass. I don't know if you can see. It is a little long. It's going like, whew, I don't know. That's about eight inches past the buckle. Don't think I need that much. I will probably end up cutting off two inches off of this. But for now, I don't give a crap. All right, here's a better view of the uh, full size and how the belt actually helps conceal the gun. I mean, I'm wearing a hoodie, so you know, if I was wearing a t-shirt, I suppose you could tell a little bit better, but you know, as it is. But 
man, this a good belt really does make all the difference in the world when you're carrying uh, concealed or outside the waistband as well. I mean, you want something stiff that's going to work, and man, this belt is just kick ass. Let me see this one. Yeah, gun is not going anywhere. That's pretty awesome. You can see from the side here. Side view. There we go. Uh, the trapper keeps it pretty dang tight to the body. You know, uh, it is a stiff belt, so this kind of wants to, you know, the end after the buckle wants to boing out of there, even after it's through my belt loop. Um, that little thing there does help quite a bit. So, yeah. I probably actually won't cut this off for now, just in case I gain another 40 pounds in the next 100 years because this belt is going to last forever, literally. So, you know, my kids are going to fight over who gets the belt in the will. <laughs> uh, all joking aside, it's a great belt, though. I'm, I'm very excited. Um, for someone who carries all the time, I... Uh, you know, I, I need a good belt, and I honestly don't think I've worn one better so far uh, than the core Essentials. So, shout out to them, and shout out to Tier 1 for the reference and uh, actually bringing the belt to my attention. Uh, Glock Precision here, thank you very much. I appreciate everything, and um, here's some clips of me rocking my shit and doing some draws and reloads. Uh, like, subscribe, and I'll bring more content. Uh, leave comments uh, with anything else you want to see me review or any, you know, constructive or shitty criticism. I accept it all. Rock and roll.